Athens adding another cross to their alliance. All right, with the three robot versus two robot advantage, starting off from Autonomous, Blue has a little bit of leeway to make up. However, right. they have three high-scoring robots there, but Bronkbus and their alliance also has some very equally high-scoring robots. We already have some scores for the Red Alliance. Let's see if the Blue Alliance can keep pace. Being at an Autonomous disadvantage, they'll have to be shooting fast and shooting accurately to make up the lost points. We see Texas Torque, the famous vacuum cleaner, almost making their shot. Just a little shy, but they're sure to get it next time. All right, Spectrum manages to make their way into the neutral zone, heading back over the ramparts. Getting that breach is important. So you get that objective point bonus. Bronkbots, once again, proving that low bar robots is not the only way to go. As they sink another one and prove that they have a high scoring alliance. 1477 shoots high, but they fall short. But Bronkbots is not. They shoot accurately and quickly. 2158 from Austin. The Austin Cans looking to get a boulder, but getting brutally defended against by the Bronx Bots. However, they get that boulder and looking to clear the defenses. Audi Boss trying to play defense on Texas Torque, but as we saw here, they drew a foul. Texas Torque, Torque getting that shot in. 456, Siege Robotics, and 2158, the Austin Cans scoring low goals in tandem, making sure they get those points down. Here comes 1477. They're in the outer works, so they can't be touched. They line up their shot, they fire, and it's too high. The pressure from Audibots is forcing Texas Torque to shoot from the outer works. However, if Audibots keeps his defense up and doesn't get fouls, they can keep Meanwhile, their alliance in this match. The Bronx Bots, however, face no defense and are free to shoot from the batter as much as they please. They're able to get those shots in. Audibots is playing very risky defense as they are touching Texas Torque while they're touching their defenses. You will get penalized if that is a repeated offense. That's another high goal from the Bronx Bots. As they put up their hanger, they look to add some scale points. There. A quick hang from the Bronx Bots. We've seen that in under six seconds. They get that, but is our alliance going to be able to make the challenge? Not to be outdone. 456, Siege Robotics adds a climb of their own, giving their whole alliance a challenge. We'll see if they scored enough boulders to match the uh, challenge. Like they're saying, it's important to remember that in the tournament, getting a breach and getting a capture are bonus points now towards your score. A breach is a bonus of 20, and a capture is bonus of 25. So this red robot being here and not there could cost the Red Alliance 25 points. And on top of that, they were contacting a robot within 20 seconds that was heading towards the batter. So that is automatically counted as a scale for the Blue Alliance. And it's the Blue Alliance!